Hello everyone! Welcome back to another ReZero episode reaction. We're watching episode 4 today. Before we begin, make sure on the description below, check out our Patreon, Discord, Instagram, all that good stuff. What is on Patreon? On Patreon, if you sign up for $1, you can get early access reactions to Pokemon and Boruto episodes. At least 4 or 5 episodes before they're put on YouTube. So a lot of shoutouts in the description of every video. Shoutouts on Instagram whenever you upload a video to your channel. As well as watch time. For your channel. What happened last time on ReZero? So he managed to to like Live? survive <laughs> for a day, for, for one day. And they beat the Bowel Hunter, Orochimaru woman. The Bowel the Hunter. Bowel Hunter. But she escaped though. Yeah. But they beat her. But she escaped. Killed her. Yeah, because of the uh, Reinhardt with his amazing sword. He's just like. <sighs> but yeah. But then he saw the... He saw something. She was holding the uh, insignia. Yeah. And, and he's, he's like, what? Oh! And so he took, he took her. the girl. Mm -hmm. For questioning. Felt. Yeah. Questioning. But uh, I just can't remember. Saitama? No. Saitama? He killed everybody in one punch. <laughs> 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 What's this guy's name? Subaru. Subaru. <laughs> Um, he, he got taken by home with Amelia. Amelia. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she got. He got taken to her her place where she stays. Yeah, yeah. And he's gonna be happy about it. He is. But and I she see. She healed everybody. And she did heal everyone. Yeah. And she healed the uh, the old man Ron. Yeah. Yeah. So now we're on to the next episode. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. I live! He lives! He lives! <laughs> wow. That is a nice house. Is that where she lives? My stomach. It's gone. All oh, things considered, it must have been a <laughs> <laughs> Like two abs? Healing power That's alright. There's two. <laughs> <laughs> two vertical abs. That's <laughs> <laughs> all you need. <laughs> the typical pattern dictates the first door is likely the goal. No, it's not. It's Bisky! What only irritating and aggravating man you are, I suppose. The first what? NPC found! The, the first like NPC found. What's NPC? It's a, a play, it's a character that's not, it's an in-game character. Uh, Doesn't she look like Bisky? She does look like Bisky. Are you upset because I guessed the right door in the first try? So are you one of those manual girls? Betty has had just about enough of you. I think it's time to teach you a lesson, I suppose. Hang on, well, what are you gonna do to me? Stay right there and don't you dare move. <laughs> Anything you'd like to say? How about don't hurt me? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do to me? You troll here and lowly. Oh, nothing much. I only collected the mana from your body, I suppose. Collected so, the mana. I that you are not an enemy. <laughs> Did he die again? I know this feeling. Oh, he's Did he die from that? Indeed, he's awakened, Rem. Oh no! Hard to believe a total he didn't die. He just got knocked so out. Early. Oh, okay. I'm getting all emotional. I should probably go to sleep a second time. No, wait a sec. If he died now, would he go right back to the beginning? My, what a deadbeat thing to say! Did you hear that, sister? Truly, the words of a loser. I heard him, Rem. Hey! What? Who are these two voices that keep criticizing me in stereo? <sighs> Maids. Wow. Screaming maid costumes exist in this world too. Wow. In my mind, maids were always the very personification of elegance. Wow. Don't underestimate the capacity of my mind. You're both fair prey, my fantasies, little maid. <laughs> <laughs> what a creepy man. Seems like you can't even wake up without causing a commotion. Oh, Subaru. <laughs> so you were the one who saved me, isn't that right, Neely? Huh? Neely? Why would you call me that? Uh, it's just a nickname, no big deal. You can't give her nicknames that soon. Right, you gotta decide. <laughs> just keep trying them out. Just keep trying to. still risk your life in order to protect mine. Wow, it's a castle. This isn't a yard, it's more like a field. We call it yard. Yard. It's a garden. My old land's ancient practice of warm up exercises and calisthenics. Come on, you should try and do it with me. Please. Yoga. Routine number two. Bounce briskly on both feet to loosen up your body. Huh? You're kidding. That's weird. 
Just do whatever I'm doing. <laughs> there you go, some yoga. That is yoga. That's good. Raise both your arms and shout victory! 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 Oh! Hi, pup. Oh! Hi there, Subaru. Great morning, isn't it? Good morning, Leo. I came really close to losing you back there, didn't I? Mm. I'll never be able to thank Subaru enough. Oh. I think I should do something for him. Yeah? Okay, let me pet your fur whenever I feel like it. Huh? Is that seriously all you want? For a first-rate fur master such as myself, being able to love on the object of your petting affection oh. anytime you want is worth just as much as the <laughs> millionaire's riches. Oh man, these ears. <laughs> <laughs> Our Lord, Master Roswell, has finally returned home. Our Lord. Please come inside. I think it's Hezekiah. Really? I'm not from upstairs. And you know what? It would appear that you are quite the imbecile, I suppose. Where do you get off saying that, you lolly? What does that word mean? I've never even heard it before, and it irritates me. I think you just made it up. Betty, haven't seen you in four days. Hope you've been doing well and staying ladylike. Oh, she completely changed character when she saw little <laughs> little furball. Yeah, sure, no problem. <laughs> my, my, how unusual to see you here, Beatrice. I'm so happy you're dining with me. I do ever so love your company and treasure our times together. That bully is more than enough addle brain fool for me, I suppose. Betty was only waiting around for Bobby. Oh. Wow, so you guys hired a clown to entertain you before each meal? I'll never understand how you rich folks think. Uh, um, Subaru, that man is actually... Oh, no, it's quite all right, Miss Amelia. I'll handle the introductions. Or... Stab wow. Him. I am, in fact, the lord of this manor, Roswell L. Mather. So he reminds me of Hezekiah, too. <laughs> he does. I wish they would have picked the same guy for the voice. That would have been, been funny. That would have been amazing. <laughs> cooking in this household. My sister doesn't happen to be very good at cooking. Ah, so it's the old twins who are good at different things trope, huh? So, your sister good at cleaning then, I take it? Yes, that's correct. My sister excels at housework chores, especially cleaning and laundry. So while you're good at cooking, you're probably bad at cleaning and laundry, right, Rim Reem? On the contrary, I'm generally good at all household tasks. I'm also better at cleaning I'm and laundry than my You're good at all tasks. Cooking, cooking, cleaning. I help though. I do help. He does. <laughs> the mansion of Margrave Mathers in the kingdom of Lagunica. Lagunica doesn't have a king. There's no king? Now don't look so alarmed. There's no need to be concerned. Everyone in this country is already quite aware of that circumstance being their reality. Wow, really? I expected that now that you know my secret, I can't let you leave you alone. Why would the Lord of the Mansion call her Miss Amelia? Well, I'm not sure how things are where you're from, but here we address those with higher status respectfully. Uh, she a princess? That would mean Mealy here is, uh... Officially, my current title is... Candidate for the 42nd ruler of the Kingdom of Lagunica. Oh, oh she's a candidate. The Honorable Lord Margrave Roswell. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. This qualifies one to be a candidate for king. Huh. It's a ceremonial touchstone that's used to determine if one is worthy to sit at the throne and lead this country as a monarch. Wait a second. What? Are you saying you lost an insignia that qualifies you to rule the kingdom? <laughs> <laughs> Don't put it like that. I didn't lose it. It was stolen from me. That's why it's so important. <laughs> What happens if you manage to lose that thing anyway? Will you die. Will issue another one? Oh, what a dreadful scenario. If you'd lost it, then there would be no doubt. The belief would be that one who can't even protect a tiny... <laughs> Some probably say that this is bad voice acting, but I think it's very good. It's hilarious. <laughs> no it's, doubt! It, it fits it really good well. <laughs> totally raises my expectations. I'm starting to like this match. Hire me to work here. Okay, that's all right. Well, the shoulders fit him funny, his legs are short, and his eyes are scary. <laughs> Those are things I can't do anything about, okay? We can't allow you to work here. And you have vertical abs. Puppy! <laughs> I love your fur! Don't worry, I won't tell a soul about this. The feel of that fur we make anyway. <laughs> oh, come on now, let me finish, you little... Oh. You just witnessed Miss Beatrice's door crossing. Oh, really? What? So it's a spell that can connect any door in the mansion to her own room, is that it? She's in here! Wow. Wow. Impressive, Subaru. All right, 
right. How did you pick the right door again? <laughs> Four, remember? I'm a flag crusher who makes game masters cry. <laughs> what are you you're talking about? Tell me, how do you fit in around here anyway? You Roswell's little sister? I would never want to be his sister, I suppose. Teddy's a librarian who oversees the Roswell Mansion's Forbidden Library. Hmm. It's kind of like the, the uh, a gatekeeper, but for the library. Hmm. I watch the library. Forbidden books. Oh, finally. <laughs> you did ask to be hired. Yeah, but he gets to live there now. Sure, yeah. I guess the workers good. live in the I mansion. Weird, so come on in. I won't do anything weird. I won't do anything weird. I must be careful and precise, but since this is yours. Wait, you cut corners because it's me? Wow. Wow. I hate to admit it, but it's perfect. How do I look? Good, huh? Stop being so cruel, you're breaking my heart! Uh -oh. You don't know how to handle a knife, Barazu. You should hold it still and simply turn the vegetable. My best dish is steamed potatoes. But well, what if it slips? Do you have to be careful? Look on your face! <laughs> Just watch it. my favorite blade shooting star will show you a thing or two about slicing! <laughs> Five days have passed since his arrival. Shouldn't we be seeing something by now? Cooking, laundry, cleaning. He's useless in all of them. How very harsh of you. And what are the chances he's a spy? This is creepy. I can't deny that such potential exists, but I think the possibility is slim at best. Because he's a better, spy. For worse. For worse, in this case in particular, he's too conspicuous. They're both only children. Even if we let them be, nothing will happen. What are they going to do? Why do they want to do stuff? Just be good people. Right? Sure is pretty. And it's up in the heavens, far beyond our reach. Well, what do you know? I got a really touching response without even trying. <laughs> On another matter, don't you think you're a bit lacking in ambition? Like that one time with Puck, and in the capital when you asked me for my name. You just don't get me at all, do you, Amelia? I want what I want at that exact moment, and I want it from the bottom of my heart. Oh. Self gratification in its purest That's form. Dumb. Why didn't you simply choose to become a permanent guest rather than an employee? I never thought of that! <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> the way I see it, this is proof of all the effort I've been putting in. Oh. I actually dislike exerting myself, you know? Like me, that's why I think. I do proof I do that I worked hard. To be honest, it's not so bad. Maybe just a little. <sighs> Kiss me, baby! <laughs> This hand I cut with a kitchen knife, <laughs> and the one on the other hand is from when I went to town in the evening to shop, and a little animal some kids were playing with bit me. <laughs> <laughs> Those kids were ruthless, hitting and kicking me, and wow. their runny noses on me. Gotta say, it kind of sucked. You do seem like the type of person who'd be good with small children, Subaru. Yeah, uh, wait, I've got ooh, an idea. Girls like Wanna that. come with me tomorrow to get revenge on those little... Uh, I mean, to watch the kids in that small animal... <laughs> It's not as if I don't want to go out there with you. Fine then, let's go. But if if I come along, it might end up causing a lot of trouble for you. Okay, understood. Let's go. <laughs> Are you even listening to me? I am, I swear. I hang on every word you say, Neely. Fine then. But only when I'm able to take a break from all of my studying and your work is done for the day, okay? I'll work hard. Yeah, alright! This is gonna be great! He got a date! <laughs> Why is he sleeping in his clothes? One, Who does it in Japan? That's how I go to sleep. Think about work for the next day. A new dawn has come across the land. Yay! Subaru Natsuki is going to make great strides today. What are you two doing in here? <laughs> embarrassing. You should have said something. Sister, sister, I do believe that our guest appears to be a bit confused. What do you think? Rem, Rem, yes, I agree. It looks as though our guest has gone crazy. Hey, why are you <laughs> calling me a guest? <laughs> you two and your silly little jokes. <laughs> what? What happened? I don't know. He, he died. He died? He died that night. He went to sleep. And it reset. 
At least he didn't have to reset right from the beginning. <laughs> yeah, but why did he die? <laughs> yeah. Who killed him? Who hasn't been killed? <laughs> He's like, he, that's why he woke up in the room that he first arrived and they're like, oh, what's, our, yeah. what's our guest, you know, acting crazy? And then he looked, his hands are back to normal because none of that ever happened. His date never happened. All that conversation, the whole day he spent, it never happened. It reset. What? <laughs> he died during the night. But he doesn't remember? He, he woke up. Is our, he must have died in his sleep. <laughs> Did someone kill him? <laughs> it's getting a bit weird. <laughs> Why would somebody kill him? I don't know. How did he die? I don't know. You do know. I do know. <laughs> I think that was a better episode than the last one. Why? That was a slow episode. Yeah, I just feel like I'm starting to get to know them a bit better. I feel like there's some weirdness in it that I'm not quite comfortable with. It's the Japanese humor of yeah. being pervy or whatever. But not too pervy. Like, they're not doing anything. No, it's just It's the just the comments. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna do anything weird. He's like, now your credibility has gone down. That was funny. I didn't like the, the weird Hisoka guy who's like stroking like, her hmm, head. Yeah. That was weird. <laughs> What's but, he plotting? Because he doesn't seem he like... He wants to know if he's a spy. Yeah. Did they just kill him? And she's gonna be like a king or a queen? Well, she's a candidate hmm. to be queen. Or a uh, ruler of the country. There's no ruler, but there's candidates. So they're, like, they're gonna do a voting, I guess, or something. Yeah. That was interesting. I yeah. feel like we're learning a bit more about you, them. It's mostly a character episode. You're just getting to know all these characters. You're gonna see these characters throughout their whole series. So yeah. get there's used to many. them. There's not many. No, there's not. But they're easy to remember. I, guess. I don't remember the names. Ram well. and Ram, I, I think, are the. As in memory. <laughs> <laughs> Emilia, um, like, Roswell, we? and uh, Bisky. <laughs> <laughs> Beatrice, I think, is what they called her. Yeah, and she's and he can manage to find her even when she. Yeah, she's like, dang it, how do you keep finding me? <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't interesting. It was all right. I'm learning a bit more, and it's intriguing why he died. Well, I was like, wow. Well, very strange. Is, I feel bad for him. Guy just got a date. He just got a date, and all this, all the work he put in was all for nothing. It just never happened. So, like, dang it. <laughs> Weird. Well, hopefully you enjoyed. I did. Hopefully all you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you did. And as always, have a great one. All right, take my measurements, because a man like me can withstand all kinds of awkwardness. <laughs> we'll measure you a bit later. Oh. Oh. Now follow me. Uh oh, he's changed it. Are you going to show me around this place?